Chapter 4 Long and Short In this chapter we are going to learn about meaning of length What are the different units of measuring length How to measure small objects using a scale How to draw a line segment using a scale how to convert one unit into another earlier people used their body parts such as hand span foot and forearm for measuring different objects but these body parts are not used as standard unit of measurement because length of palm and hand are different for different person which causes error in the measurement then came tools like metric scale ruler measuring tape which were used as standard units of measuring length they gave accurate measurement and were even same for different person length tells us how long an object is there are different units of measuring length but the basic unit of measuring length is meter it is written as small m the other units of measuring length are centimeter millimeter and kilometer centimeter is a smaller unit of measuring length we use centimeter for measuring small length such as the length of a pencil pen eraser laptop mobile phone we use meter for measuring medium lengths such as length of a room length of a sofa height of a door meter is a basic unit of measuring length the biggest unit of measuring length is kilometer The short form of kilometer is km. Kilometer is used to measure long distance such as distance between two cities, distance between your home to school. Now we are going to learn relation between meter, centimeter and kilometer. We all know that meter is the basic unit of measuring length. Centimeter is the smaller unit of measuring length. And kilometer is the biggest unit of measuring length. 1 meter equal to 100 cm. It means 100 cm makes 1 meter. relation between kilometer and meter is 1 kilometer is equal to 1000 meter 1000 meter makes 1 kilometer now we are going to learn how to measure thing using ruler or scale a picture given below is a picture of a ruler a ruler is a tool used to measure length the long marks under which numbers are written on the ruler denote centimeters 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 
these are centimeters the smaller marks between each centimeter represent millimeter there are 10 small lines between each centimeter therefore 10 mm make 1 cm now let us learn how to measure things using ruler to measure the length of an object place the zero mark of the ruler exactly along one end of the object align the object you are measuring along the edge of the ruler note the mark on the ruler along which the other side of the object end for example if you want to measure the length of a pen you have to put one end of the pen at the zero point and see the other end of the pen the other end of the pen lies on 5 so the length of the pen is 5 cm similarly now see the length of a pencil one end lies on the 0 and the other end lies on the 10 so the length of a pencil is 10 cm in this way we are going to measure the things using ruler let us explore measure each object using the ruler let us find the length of the pointer to find the length of the pointer see the starting point of the pointer the starting point is lies on the zero then see the end point of the pointer the end point of the pointer lies on the nine so the length of the pointer will be 9 cm now let us find the length of a leaf the starting point of the leaf lies on 0 and the end point of the leaf lies on the 5 so the length of the leaf is 5 cm Now let us find out the length of the nail. So always keep the starting point of the nail at the zero mark. Then see the end point of the nail. The end point of the nail lies between 2 and 3. So now what will be the length of the nail? The length of the nail will be Now we will learn to draw a line segment using a scale. Step 1. Mark a point in your notebook and label it as A. Place the scale in such a way that the zero mark on the scale coincides with A. Move the sharp end of a pencil along the edge of the scale till it reaches to the point 9 cm on the scale. Label the second end as B. AB is the required line segment and it is 9 cm. Now let us explore. What would you use to measure these? Centimeter, meter, or kilometer? We have already learned 
a centimeter is used to measure smaller objects meter is used to measure medium size object and kilometer is used to measure long distance now the first question is height of a building we all know that the height of a building is always tall so it is measured in meter distance from mumbai to chennai long distance are measured in kilometer so distance from mumbai to chennai is measured in kilometer length of a mouse tail we all know that the mouse tail is small so it is measured in centimeter length of a sari we all know that sari length is big so it is measured in meter length of the india's coast line we all know that india coast line is very long so it is measured in kilometer length of a scissor scissor is small so it is measured in centimeter 